Well, I have a mandate from my party uh, to bring change to the country, change that will benefit the youth of the country, change that will benefit the common man, the women who sell in the market, the children who go to school where there are no toilets, the youth who do not have a job. We want to solve those problems in this country. We want to diversify the economy. We want to ensure that our, uh, the economy is, is being run properly so that our people, our businessmen can have confidence and invest. We also want to ensure that we, we, we end corruption. Uh, we're losing a lot of money. We estimate 60 to 100 million dollars a year just because people steal it. That's money we can use in the schools. That's money we can use in the hospitals. That's money we can use for people. Answer that. We also want to ensure that we take care of our teachers. If they have good incentives, they will teach properly in school. We want to take care of the teachers, make them more professional. We want to take care of our servicemen and the ex-servicemen who have protected this country. I know recently, for PD, I want to recognize the people in the armed forces, those who are still existing, those who are ex-servicemen. Thank you for bringing democracy to our country. Yes, we we to need to improve your conditions of service. Uh, Doctor, actually, what brought the establishment of this particular party in Sierra Leone? You were at SFDB before, and now you've become uh, a new leader for Anglo Party. But the, desire, the desire for change brought this party about. We struggled in this country. We, we interacted with many political parties, trying to find a platform, a platform that gives people to participate in a clean, fair process, to, so that they decide how they want to be led. So that is what brought us about. And it is also because when I go around this country, I see what the youth, their condition, their, 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 their lifestyles. I go around this country, I see the farmers, the Okada riders, I know they want improvement in their lives. And when I looked at the establishment, the orthodox parties, I knew they were not ready for change. They were not ready to look ahead 10, 20 years from now, how we can make Sierra Leone great. It was just simply business as usual. You know, for let we change the driver. One driver from one other one car, not all that we want. We want change the motor car. We no want bad engine, even if you get good driver, that's another thing. So now that's bring NGC. Now that make all call a DD. Now party for everybody. So I thank them for giving me this opportunity for let lead them in 2018, for let we make youth man life better, the common man life better, the woman, eh? them picking them, let we improve their life. And let we make sure see, the, 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 the property the way God given at this country under the ground, na the water side, na the sea. Let we use them for the salon man, and then say country force, salon force, yes. salon people then force. Yes, doctor, with the assurance, we will give the people of Sierra Leone that you will become the next elected, democratically elected president. I they give them the confidence say we will win 2018. Because we own party, na the youth man there, and then youth woman, na then get for put we inside power. And that make they encourage youth man and then youth woman there. If you don't pass 31, you, you community respects you, not afraid for country with for symbol. But we want evidence say you community respects me. We want let you, then young begin they self take charge of their country. Because now they get more life for leave. Let them work with will or change the country. So youth man, youth woman, now on a party this, I they look for young picking them. Me, I don't be minister already by 33 in this country. And I do well. By that 10 day, wait, man, don't give me big job. So, now the same thing, I want competence.